You good, Aunt Lil? Better. Seeing you again. But I'm about ready to get off my feet. Where's your car? Take me to Sammy's. You sure? I'm sure. Father James told me about your friend, Anne. Anna. She, uh, passed away. Where'd you end up going? Hmm. Patch of land where Sammy and me grew up. They lived on a farm. Sharecropper, right? Till our daddy got hurt, couldn't work no more. Sammy bought the land a few years back. Lincoln. Never underestimate the value of a black man owning what's his. I wanted to come see you after. No, you did right. Made sense. Folks thinking I didn't make it out. Sal Marcano. You see to him? I made it right, Aunt Lil. Oh, no. What did they do to this place? Best to go in through the garage. Didn't leave much to work with. But the structure's more or less intact. Gonna have to gut the interior. You wanna reopen Sammy's? I want you to do it. I'll just help you get the place back into shape. Maybe some improvements here and there, too. What do I know about running a bar, Aunt Lil? It's important enough for you to figure it out. People in the holler need to see black folks owning their own, just like Sammy did. Look, if you want, just get me the cash I need to start repairs. It's in rough shape, but I've handled worse. Should have seen Pearlers in the early days. Just let me know when you want to kick off the renovations around here. Let's get started. Damn. <sighs> this is wild. How did you... Spent a lot of years helping Sammy make this place what it was. Just came natural putting it back together. Might be good to fix up the back. Get a pool table in there like Sammy always wanted. We could do a lot here. Got plenty of options for what to do next. Money is the only limit. You're really putting your mark on this place, Lincoln. Place is looking good enough to charge a cover. Sammy looks real good up there, baby. Damn, man, Lil, you starting to make Sammy's look like something. Boy, this is all you. You putting your mark on.
Any of you coons hold up in there better come out right now! Y'all hear me? We aim to burn this shit all to the ground! Dixie, mother... Aunt Lil, I need you to get these people downstairs. I'll slip out through the garage and deal with this. I gotta check that out. I see one more Dixie piece of shit coming after Sammy's, and it's your ass. Yeah, yeah! Whatever you say, big man! Goddamn right. Night-night, motherfucker. Dixie boys shouldn't be a problem anymore. Honey, as long as you're black, angry white boys will always be a problem. You ain't wrong. So, what's next, honey? Let me know what you want to work on next. Well, at least you ain't sleeping rough down there anymore. Maybe we can do a fish fry now and then. Smart. Give folks some good food with their liquor, and they'll stay all night.
Guess that now we got a juke, I should give one of them rock records a try. Welcome back. Let's see what else we can do. We better be careful. Folks might start thinking we know what we're doing around here. Fell at the bars, Reggie. Our new bartender. Well, he's supposed to be, but he needs some help dealing with a car he lost in a race. Reggie's all right. Just gets... Mixed up in mess sometimes. Reggie, the Sammy's boy, right? Nice to see the place up and running again. Thanks. Now, what's this I hear about you losing your car? <laughs> Got my dumb ass in a pink slip race. White boy named Shorty won her down in the bayou. Okay. If I get your ride back from Shorty, you come work for me? If you win. But Mr. Clay, Shorty will be driving my car. She moves like a goddamn rocket, but that means you can overtake her around the corner. Get yourself something fast that can handle turns. Oh, I'll do that, man. Hold tight, Reggie. Get my car back, and sure, I'll work for you. Nice wheels, man. She just for show? Fuck, son. I'll race you for pinks right now. That's a fine car, son. Can't wait to take it from you.
Holy shit, man. You showed shorty. <laughs> See you at the bar? No doubt. Talk to Miss Lily when you're ready to bring me on. Place is really starting to come together. Keep at it. That's going to bring the whole place together. You got some style, boy. I like it. Good to see you, Oscar. <laughs> well, the state you left La Nuit Blanche, I was in need of new employment. Honestly, thanks for giving this broke-down vet a chance. Sure. We don't look out for each other. Who will? Sammy's is looking downright respectable, boy. You might be too young to remember when Sammy had that mural put up. He was so proud. Glad to have the upstairs livable again. 